Hi, this is Michael, KB9VBR. Today we're doing a little bit of a public service activity. Want to learn more? Stay tuned. It's a good location for this GoPro. It's perfect for it. So today we're out here at the, the MS Walk. This is a relatively short little um, 3K, 5K walk run. It's a benefit to help um, multiple sclerosis. Really, really great activity. It's a beautiful sunny day here. And um, what we do is provide health and welfare communications. As you can see, uh, we kind of, the walk kind of follows some path that's really inaccessible to vehicles. So uh, amateur radio communications is vital. It's really critical to, to keep the walkers safe as they're out and about here, you know, three, four hundred people. So what should you bring along with you into the field when doing a public service activity like this? My standard equipment kit includes a two meter HT with a speaker mic, an earpiece, which is handy in noisy environments, an aftermarket antenna with a bit of gain, the stock antennas that you find on many of those Chinese handheld radios are notoriously bad, small notepad and a pen and, or pencil, safety vest, and clothing appropriate for the conditions. Hydration is important when you're out here in events like this, so make sure you bring plenty of water. And also, hat and sunscreen too would be great for a day like today. So do as I say, not as I do. <laughs> That's it, get a whole water? Pretty much, yeah. Pretty much. Okay, so we got the two in water. <laughs> I said, I don't know how many times to go here, but never see this. Hey, we're catching up, look at that. So what are the benefits, some of the benefits of doing public service activities? Well, number one, of course, it gets you out into the community. Your amateur radio club is seen in a positive light, providing service to nonprofit groups and organizations that may not otherwise be able to provide communications for their events. Secondly, it's a great uh, training exercise for whatever there's the case that you're needed for an emergency communication standpoint. Practicing and drilling in events like this keeps you ready for when you're, you're needed on a more of an emergency kind of situation. You're lucky you don't have to run. That's right, you ran the whole way? No kidding. Yeah, I'm kidding. <laughs> Thanks for joining us out here today at the MS Walk. It's been a beautiful day. You can always find more information about on my blog, wwwjpaul antennacom check it out sometime. Also uh, subscribe to this YouTube channel. Plenty of videos up, up there and more to come. This is Michael, KB9 VBR. <laughs> this is the end of the line. All right. Good job. <laughs> I gotta get a little motivation. <laughs>